All right, we're back at it. <clears throat> this is Don't Give Up the Ship. Please like and subscribe. I got two new products to try. This time we're gonna give 3M Auto Advanced Adhesive Remover a try and Gugon Pro Power Goo Adhesive Goo and Adhesive Remover a try. As you guys saw in the last video, we tried Goof Off and Zippo. Goof Off seemed to be the winner in this one. But we also have one more contender I forgot to mention, and uh, that's beer. And that's definitely gonna help us this time. All right, and I got some new strategies to try, so here we go. Have you ever tried it? So first off, we're gonna give uh, the 3M adhesive remover a try. Uh, we'll see how that works out and um, show you the process. All right, so we'll give this 3M adhesive remover a try. I'm also gonna use this stiff bristled brush to scrub. So um, shake this stuff up. This stuff's pretty potent. Uh, as far as the smell goes, but uh, I give it a good coat, get this stuff wet, let it sit for about 10 or 15 seconds. And then uh, I just use this scrub brush. And it seems to really just come out very easily. Take this rag and I wipe it down, and yeah, uh, this glue it, comes off pretty good. Because it's not working for my rag. Yeah. And my buddy Harvey over here helping me a little bit too. What's that? What do you use that for? I'm getting this glue off. Yeah, but Dad, I want to use that. Okay. Can I do this is pretty toxic stuff. I don't want you to get it on your skin. Why? Why Dad? Be careful, buddy. Don't knock that camera, please. Okay. Dad, I want to use that. Dad, I want to use that scrubber thing. All right, buddy. I'll let you try here in a minute. Okay. And I just take a rag and wipe it off. But Dad, I want that scrubber thing. All right, buddy. Hold on. Cut. Camera's on, okay? Okay. All right, guys. So this seems to be working very well. This um, 3M Auto Advanced Adhesive Remover I found on Amazon. I'll leave it in the link below. Uh, but it works really well. Move on to another area to show you how Gugon Pro Power removes. All right, new fresh area here. I'll show you how this Gugon Pro Power remover works. does not seem to have near the power that the other stuff has. In fact, it's really doing nothing other than smelling like oranges.
it is coming up, but it sure requires quite a bit more scrubbing there. So definitely the clear winner is the 3M Advanced Auto Adhesive Remover. Um, I have a bunch more of this on order. in the background there learning how to hammer and nail Side to this product is the smell. It does work very very well and I am out of it so I will go on to working on sticker removal which is a slow and tedious process but we'll get that done So looking at these areas, you know, this specific area, this is just a glue that they use, probably 5200 or something to that extent. They used it on all the different points um, to attach the T-top. And I'm guessing it's probably just to help secure it a little bit better. But what I plan to do is to use butyl tape in there and that'll help with the rattle and it'll also secure it to there and seal the water holes or any any areas where it could leak into the center console um, which there's lots of areas on this boat that that could happen or lots of areas on the center console that could happen um, so that's the that's the plan is to use butyl tape so i'm actually going to probably sand this area down and get it really all right so i got this sticker and one more behind the mfd which i will do at a later time and i'm going to rename this boat 
I know there's some things that say you shouldn't do rename a boat, but I don't really like go fish. So I have, I have to use some of that adhesive remover to get some of this off because this is kind of a, like a rough surface area. So I'm trying not to dig into it or create any scratches here. Like I said, we'll give Goof Off one more try. Uh, we'll try using the scrub brush instead. I did try Goof Off with the scrub brush. It did better than the Zippo fluid, but you know, Zippo's by far the loser. Followed by Goo, what is it, Goo Gone. Yeah, Goo Gone is probably the, the second loser. I'm sure it'd probably work well for some of these stickers residues and whatnot to come off of the windshields and you know the sides of the boat but um but anyway uh that's my conclusion for that so here we go all right here's a little goof off It actually seems to be doing a lot better than I remembered it. It does require a little more elbow grease though. And a spray bottle would certainly help. I am officially out of product. I used the goof off to get most of this done. Actually turning out to come off pretty easy with the goof off. More work than the 3M product. I got more of the 3M product coming. But uh, clean rag is really important. Uh, scrub brush not so much, but keeping those areas, you know, kind of wet is the most helpful thing. Um, so anyway, this uh, is coming along here. Probably got another two hours of work once that other product comes in the mail. I'm getting started on uh, taping off the boat a little bit. Uh, just trying to use my time. Well, I got it. Well, my wife is watching the kids, but uh, just going to tape off all this stuff before we get into uh, wet sand and polishing and stuff so uh, we'll tape off the water line and everything here uh, so that's what we're doing <laughs> 